then it wasn't too long after that that uh, he, um, we shot down a, a, a Fock Wolf German airplane, a four-engine four plane, over Iceland, and uh, it was up in the mountains and near the glaciers. And uh, I had the assignment of taking a contingent of men up there to see what, if anything, was recoverable or was a living soldiers, the Germans and so forth. And it took us a couple of days to get up to it, and maybe longer than that. It was very difficult traveling in that, that type of terrain. But I got up there, and of course the, the, <clears throat> the Germans were, were all killed. Uh, and I uh, had the uh, remains of everything searched as far as we could, and I found one very important code book, which was uh, extremely important. I, I didn't realize its importance at the time, although I knew it was a code book, and I, I, uh, I, I took it myself, and, uh, and after a few days got back down to the base, base headquarters again, and uh, then we, we saw that we really had something because all of the codes of the Germans uh, for the airplanes to the submarines and all sorts of things, here was the German code all handed to us, you know. And when we when we telegraphed our, our headquarters over in uh, in London, and they got excited, sent a B-24 up and sent me down with the with the code book, and I turned it over to them, and they uh, they in turn, of course, got it to Metzlik Park and other places. And it turned out to be a a real a real boon to the to the uh, people who were coding decoding the Germans because it told everything, everything it was.